Okay, it's fine. Hello, everyone. I want to give a shout out to all my subscribers. I have 156, and I'm very excited to be coming out with my first recording of my desktop here. So, yeah, I just want to give a shout out to all my subscribers. Got 156 of them. May not seem like much, but yeah. It's been a lot of work to put together my channel. As you can see, I have made my latest video as a Gresham Coplock intro vid. That will be going it will be going into most of my vids that I upload. It'll be an intro that just keep Keep it interesting. I know I'm boring. I'm very boring. Whoa. Shit. Well, no matter. But thank you very much for those who have subscribed to me. I appreciate the support and everything. Um so yeah. I'm very proud of my hard work and dedication to what I've been doing as far as like going from being a political activist to filming the police and holding them accountable whenever. I'd also like to give a shout out to uh, Mike Bluehair who's also on YouTube and pretty well known for his um, police vids and random stuff. <laughs> Mike uh, Bluehair is a best bud of mine. I'm giving him a shout out because he's, he's pretty awesome. You should give him a... You should subscribe to him and watch his videos and whatnot. I'd also like to give a shout out to um, Oregon Cop Block. That's on YouTube. They do a lot of great work. They've been around longer than I have um, in activism. So, so yeah, check them out too. They have a lot of um, police vids where they record the police documenting things. Um. And a special shout out to um, co-founder of Oregon Cop Block, um, Chris Ponto. He's also a buddy of mine, just like uh, Mike. Mikey is so. So yeah, pretty excited. <laughs> um, oh yeah, and a and a shout out to Robert. He know who he is. <laughs> He's also been out with me filming the police. Been around him for a while too. Did some things with him. Uh, he's an awesome person. I also appreciate all the support I've gotten from uh, Mike Smith, aka Mike Blue Hair, and Chris Ponte. Thank you very much for all the support and help. It's been a pleasure uh, working with you guys. It's been a swell pleasure. What else was I going to say? Um, well, shoot. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, yeah, that's right. Um... I'm I'm the founder of Gresham Cop Block. Everyone knows me by the name of da um, Dax. Sorry, I stuttered there. Well, not stuttered, but bad, <laughs> bad, uh, <clears throat> bad voice right there. But I'm but I'm the founder of Gresham Cop Block. I founded Gresham Cop Block for the very reason to 
patrol and film the police in Gresham, Oregon. So I've been dealing with the Gresham PD. As you can see, there's a vid right here that I'm scrolling over. Gresham PD pulling over a bicyclist. That was a week ago. That was interesting stuff, actually. But I've been uh, been doing a lot of stuff lately. Been involved with the Don't Shoot Portland movement, and, and been involved with Like by Portland. Everyone probably knows me around, knows me from Occupy Gresham with my family and whatnot. <laughs> but yeah, had quite the adventures for th about three years. Had quite the adventure, and I'm, I'm a strong believer in what I believe in. We can all agree that corruption amongst amongst the world is tearing us apart it's making us like a bunch of savages because we're always at war especially the US I just wish these wars would end I wish people would um, step up and actually do something about it and either through civil disobedience or or shutting shit down you know but yeah you get my point but I made a I made a lot of progress over the three years going from Occupy Portland to Occupy Gresham being involved a little bit with um, Veterans for Peace in Portland. Veterans for Peace, they're, they're a cool organization. Um, also, I'm going to shout out to them because they do a lot of, they do a lot of educating. Um, and uh, they do their, they do their own civil disobedience too. Um, Veterans for Peace goes way back, like I think it goes way back to the 70s because of the anti-war movement. A lot of people were against the Vietnam War. Let's, uh, what's our time right now? It's about eight minutes. Yeah, we're just now coming up to eight minutes in my recording session. But I have quite the collection here. I have quite the collection here. Um, not sure how many vids in total. I would say probably about a hundred. <laughs> I'd have to go and count manually. Um, there was one interesting thing that I actually got to experience, and that was the Portland police using flashbangs two months ago in in Dunch in the Black Lives Matter movement and don't shoot Portland movement um, that was crazy I had that um, I had that filmed as you can see right here let's click on it oh come on load there we go all right, let's turn it to HD now. Come on. There we go. One interesting thing was, was definitely the flashbangs. That was just pure crazy. Ah, jeez. Internet connection's a little bit bad, sorry. But I experienced flashbangs for the first time, and that was really interesting. But yeah. But yeah, that was interesting. Sorry, I had to turn down the volume, because I'm pretty sure you might not be able to hear me. 
But we start moving, and then you can see that they start getting their gunmen in the front. Then one, two, three. That was a flashbang that blinded me for a second. And what's really crazy about this is Portland Right Police just start charging at everyone. It's like my most dramatic vid right now. See that shit? That was messed up. What's our time right now? 10 minutes? Okay, well, we're gonna wrap it up here. Mike, blue hair, as you can see on the side panel that I'm looking at. Um, he posted that. Let's go back to my channel. But yeah, please subscribe to me if you like my work. Um, share my videos. I'd like them to go as far as possible. I'd really appreciate it. I, I would so love you, um, or whoever watches this, to really subscribe. I also recommend subscribing to Oregon Cop Block and Mike Blue Hair. They're they're interesting. They have um, they have really good quality and leadership. So, yeah. Oh, and a shout out to um, Carrie Medina. Just recently, she um. Recently, in an Oregon Live article, she's going to go fight in court after an incident that was about two years ago that I think was back in February of um, 2012 or 2013. Yeah. So she's going to fight in court after um, Gresham police officer Letzis, who was, all, who was in a Portland police uniform, um, illegally confiscated her phone. But I give a shout out for her bravery and courage. And I appreciate the work she does along with um, FTP Portland, which has filmed the police Portland. There's lots of cool peeps and a shout out to Bob. Oh, I, I love you guys. <laughs> and a shout out to all my friends that I've made throughout the throughout the three years I've been as an activist it, it's just amazing with the people who I've come to meet and so on but yeah if you're interested in subscribing just look at Falcon 500 spat <laughs> subscribe to me share my videos I want to hold the police accountable and I'm documenting people rising up against corruption. So, uh, in a way, I'm a journalist. I'm a journalist and I'm a revolutionary all at the same time. Uh, okay, we're coming up to 14 minutes. So, we're going to wrap it up here with a little bit of crossroads. Thank you so much for um, watching, and I'll be sure to make more. I was actually excited to figure out how to record from my Linux desktop here. I'm using Simple Screen Recorder, and it's free and open source. I have about three free and open source um, um, recording software that can record it like your desktop and whatnot. And, and as a future reference, in the future, I might be recording uh, games because this this is my YouTube account that I had way before I was an activist. I've had this thing for four years, but now it's become dominated by political activism. So and cop watching. So yeah, so you might run into uh, might run into some things. that are not related, so don't freak out, but if you're a fan of me, cool, I love it. If you're a hater, I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna 
do what I want to do and what I believe in. Someone's got to stand up. Come on. But I hope you enjoyed my first recording. I'm sorry I'm a little bit boring and not much to do right now, but yeah, and yeah. Let's watch my video intro. Really quick to end our little yes. session. Today begins a new order. Your lands, your possessions, your very lives will gladly be given in tribute to me. In return for your obedience, you will enjoy my generous protection. In other words, you will be allowed, be allowed to, to live. All right, Gresham Cup block out.